when we found out that number one we could open and number two you know that we could actually still host this event you know it was kind of having pretty exciting times for us I mean we didn't know what was going to happen with this event but I think it's great to see all the players here you know and the best players in the province 25 and older and I think it's excellent and you know great for the golf course as well so yeah. Well. I think it's great for the, uh, you know, the sundry economy for sure. You know, like you said, hotels, um, you know, restaurants, that type of thing. You know, I think it's, you know, great for a little town. Um, good exposure as well, you know, for us here at the club. And, uh, you know, it's, it's going to be a really good week here. Great as well. Oh, it's a blast. Uh, competitive golf is what uh, a lot of us, you know, play this game for. And to be out here and be allowed to do this is, is wonderful. First off, first competitive round of the year none of us knew if this would be possible a couple of months ago just how good did it feel to be out there competing being with friends uh, just yeah what was no, it like it was good it was a lot of fun um i mean it took a little bit of getting used to for sure the first few holes with the stuff in the pin and trying to figure that out um but yeah i mean it's uh we weren't sure a few weeks ago i don't think if this was going to happen so yeah it's it's i think everyone's pretty pumped to be out here yeah, it's great. Uh, huge thanks to Alberta Golf and all the golf courses. I know there was a lot of uncertainty, but it's awesome that everyone stepped up. And if there was one event that you really think, you know, social distancing works, it's golf on a square foot of a property on a golf course. is quite big, so it's easy to separate. And, you know, huge kind of congratulations to Alberta Golf and the golf courses for setting it up. Yeah, and I guess the question was this, this, the surveying. Did, did, did it surprise you that 100% the courses are in, the players are in, everyone wants to do it? I think everyone, like out at Glencoe where I'm a member, it's been impossible possible to get a tea time because everyone's so gung-ho to get out of the you know house or the office so it's awesome that everyone stepped up and I know the players always want to play but I think it's you know huge kudos to the golf courses for taking the risk and probably having extra staff out here to make sure it's run properly and safely so uh, pretty cool to see how it was all set up.